tomorrow we can start it then This is canned from the vegetable guys, I didn't throw that and this is the mason that I always use for making the junk. Thanks for watching guys, bye! Hello guys! Welcome back to Dina Low Carbs Diet. Ibabahagi ko po sa inyo or isishare ko sa inyo ang aking keto kimchi. Guys, ito po'y napakadali lang at ito po'y napaka-appetizer po ng kimchi na ito. Masarap ito talaga pang, ano, pang side dish. Kaya, guys, ituro ko sa inyo sa mga nagda-diet dyan at namimiss na ang kimchi. Ito yung kasagutan ng inyong cravings. Kaya, guys, uh, let's go! Um, papakita ko sa inyo kung paano ko ginagawa ang aking own version kimchi. Madali lang ito, guys. Uh, simple lang ang kanyang ingredients. Sigurado akong hindi kayo mahihirapan sa uh, pagbabudget nito dahil kung ano lang meron kayo sa kusina, yun lang din ang gagamitin nyo. Ayun na, guys! First, we have two cabbage Chinese cabbage here that normally we use it for kimchi. So I'm gonna cut them in the bite size. So, ganyan lang siya kalaki. Ganyan lang. Bite size lang. Ano? Bite size lang tayo. Ganyan lang siya. Ikat lang natin siya ng ganyan para madaling kainin. So, guys. Katapos natin itong hiwain, hugugasan po natin ang ating cabbage. Ngayon guys, ay anuhin natin siya na um, salt. Ang gamit kong salt guys is Himalayan salt. Tapos ko na siya mahugasan. Dalawang beses ko po siyang hinugasan. Ayan, malinis na malinis na siya. Ayan. So, ang gamit po natin ano guys, ang gamit po natin salt is Himalayan salt. Ito pong gamit ko. Meron din po ako ng powder. Nagamit po ako nito. Dagdagan ko siya ng, ano, ng powder. And powder salt. Malangin salt. 
Hugasan naman natin ito guys. I-re-rinse natin ito pagkatapos mamaya in 10 minutes. We leave it 10 minutes right, then we rinse that. So guys, so habang binababad natin yun ng ano on the Himalayan salt we gonna cut our carrot our onion ginger and our dry chili guys, let's go guys now I'm gonna cut the one carrot one carrot guys into the blender ginger into the blender and two onion into the blender two onion into the blender guys and the, the rest of the two is for later. And it's also for later. So that is in the blender, guys. That is in the blender. And our uh, dried chili into the blender. And then we put some half a spoon of Himalayan salt powder. I'm gonna put one spoon of um, garlic powder. Garlic powder, guys. Because I don't have the fresh garlic. I'm out of the fresh garlic, so I use powder. Now, for our thickener, we use Xiangtan gum. Xiangtan gum. So we use this as a thickener, just half a teaspoon, half a teaspoon. This is not the same as uh, rice flour, so we use half a teaspoon for our thickener. And now we put uh, half a cup of uh, fish oil. So guys, everything is in the blender. Everything is in the blender. I'm gonna blend it. Hold on. I'm gonna blend it, guys. Oh, that is really spicy. It's going to throw into my eye. I'm going to rinse now, guys. The other cabbage. I'm gonna rinse it. I'm gonna rinse that. I'm gonna rinse it three times. Three times, guys. So, guys, I wash it three times already. I rinse it three times, so the salt is gone. The salt is gone guys so now we leave it for another five minutes to dry it out so guys while we are waiting for our cabbage to dry it out we cut this carrot in the strips 
and then the ginger and the onion we cut it in the strip okay so are we gonna cut it in the strip we cut it like that so I use two carrots on this side because we are people we cannot consume more than that the one carrots that I bring guys is to replace the sugar you know normally we need to put sugar on the kimchi that is the original recipe but because we cannot I use carrots instead of sugar to make it sweet so how can you remove the sweetness of carrots you have to blend them don't make it juice guys because if you juice it it's more worse it's better you blend it so you can also consume the fiber so that's it guys we can, we're gonna cut this all in the stripe now guys I'm done cutting my uh, ginger onion and carrots and the spring onion so I'm gonna mix my sesame seeds So guys, we're gonna mix it now. This is already dry for five minutes. We're gonna mix it all together. Our carrots, our onion. So we're gonna mix it, guys. They are all in the bowl, so we just mix it. I'm gonna mix it here. So we want to bring it here closer. And then we're gonna add our sauce. This is the sauce that we make homemade sauce in our keto way of kimchi. This is carrots, ginger, onion, and um, Chantang gum, uh, fish sauce, and the dried chili. And this is super, super spicy, guys. My god, even just the smell is. <laughs> Terry eyes me, Terry eyes. We don't wasting the rest. I will grab it with a smaller spoon. So this is our I'm gonna mix it through guys so guys the mix na natin ang ating kimchi ayan na siya again natin ang sesame seeds I used two color black and white but they are all roasted so mix it so guys, and ito na yung ating pinising ng ating kimchi. So ilalagay ko sila sa mason jar. Ayan ang ating mason jar. Ilalagay ko sila sa mason jar. At kapag hindi kulang pa ito, ilalagay ko rin dito sa ating jar from the vegetable. Ayan. Extra. Kasi tatlo lang yung available ko mason jar dahil may laman na jam. <laughs> Raspberry jam. Kaya ito guys, yung ating um, homemade keto kimchi from scratch. 
from a uh, uh, Nandito na ako. <laughs>